So let's talk about always install elevated uh, policy and how it can be used to gain privileged escalation. So always install elevated is a policy to install a Windows installer package, which is basically MSI uh, file, and uh, install that package with elevated privileges, uh, usually as system uh, with system privileges. So in other words, when the user runs um, a MSI installer, system will recognize if it's uh, configured properly, it will recognize that this package has to be uh, run as with elevated privileges to allow a uh, low uh, privileged user to install that, that software on the computer. Okay. So how you can check the uh, if the setting is is in place so we need to uh, check two values in uh, in registry the first one is in in local machine setting okay so it says always uh, always install elevated uh, set to one and the second uh, setting is the same but for current current user hive, okay. So it also has to be set to one. Uh, always install elevated. So if you see these two values set, it means that even uh, uh, even a low privileged user without any local admin privs can run MSI installer and install software on the computer. And install software means um, in many times writing values in local machine registry or uh, saving files in um, program files folder etc okay so how we can abuse that um, metasploit framework has the feature to generate a meterpreter um, payload as the msi uh, file okay so you potentially could use that and run it here but there is a caveat uh, most most of the AV engines will detect that so you have to find a way to bypass AV uh, to run that package so what I do instead uh, I try to use legitimate software to generate MSI package and this package will it will contain my implant which will get uh, run during the installation process and will get elevated privileges. And one of the packages you can use for that is MSI wrapper. So it's installed on the system. And uh, it's really simple wizard guided uh, setup when you want to generate MSI. Uh, I already prepared uh, the pre-configured configuration file. Okay, so you have to go to uh, our L, uh, RTO LPE directory and use MSI template.xml. So open that, click next. Now you point your uh, path to your implant. So in our case, it's RTO LPE implant slash implant.exe. Um, and output file will be saved in LPE uh, folder as implant.msi. So we click next. Now this is crucial set setting. So you set security context for launching the executable for Windows installer to always elevate as per user, okay? And MSI package requires elevation. That's how it has to be set. Click next, the product name, you can make it more legitimate so you can actually set the ver versions, comments, etc. You can manually set these values, but it's not important to generate for our MSI. We click next, 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 uh, and build, and no. And our package is already on the disk. Let's see it. So let's go to C, RTO, LPE, and here's our implant.msi. So the next thing you need 
is to run to run uh, to install that uh, package so let me show you that i'm running as medium integrity in medium integrity level okay i'm a i'm a regular user i'm rto uh, user who's not an, a local admin at, at all but what you need to run right now is to use msi exec quiet uh, and install rto lpe implant msi.exe okay and notepad has popped up which is a good, good sign so let's investigate that it's actually running a system so we need elevated pro process hacker so let me find this guy okay so here you can see that msi.exe is running a system okay our installer and our package has been uh, unpacked and our implant.exe has been running has, has run and our payload got executed and then here's our notepad and now our notepad is running as system okay with system integrity level and a bunch of good privileges at hand okay um yeah that's after some time uh, the msi just get get uh, kills the the, the uh, package installer once it's it didn't respond um, properly but our our process our notepad elevated notepad is uh, is running again because it's an independent process it's here and uh, so again if you want to use that technique just edit implant and place your payload there uh, and you should be good